Hey, Bless Babes, this is the Kalia Show, just in case you didn't know. Hey, Bless Babes, this is the Kalia Show, just in case you didn't know, and I'm back with another video. So today, I've got a package. Woo! And this is from Victoria's Secret, and I was like, <laughs> why not do a little unboxing or unpacking? I don't know, but let's just get right into it. It is Sunday. I hope you guys are having a blessed day. Um, I actually am going to church in a little while. Super excited about that. How are you guys doing? How is your week? So while I am unboxing this stuff, I wanted to tell y'all about my week. So I went on an interview a while ago and um, then I had orientation this past week. And the very next day after orientation, I started a new job. So I am now a substitute teacher. <laughs> and let me just tell y'all, it is the crazy, ex it, it's been a crazy experience so far. When I told my mom the school that I was um, gonna be subbing at for my first day, she was like, are you crazy? Um, ooh, I forgot even what I ordered. So this is aloe scrub, soothing face and body. I don't think I would put this on my face, but let's see what it smells like. I got ordered, mmm, it's like jelly. Mmm, okay, this smells really bomb. Look at that. Mmm, I can't wait to use that on my body. Um, so anyway, I sucked at and I a, a high school. I chose a high school. Y'all probably think I'm crazy because like, I probably look like a freaking high schooler in this video with my hair like this. But I chose to sub at a high school because I wanted to give myself the challenge. I'm experienced in elementary schools already. All last year, I was working in um, elementary schools. Oh, this is cute. A little sweatshirt, hoodie. There's no um, hood. Wait, this is not a hood, it's just like a neck thing. Anyway, that's cute. Um, all last year I was in elementary school, so I was already experienced with the little ones. So I was like, I'm gonna do a high school, and I'm gonna choose a high school that may not particularly be popular to go to. So I did that, um, and it said Spanish teacher needed. So I was like, bet, I'm gonna go. So I go in there, as soon as I get in there, there's like a white lady at the front desk, and she's like, she like mugged me, and she was like, yes. I was like, oh, I'm here to sub today. And she was like, and she like pointed to the front desk, like telling me to go over there. I'm like, okay, shade is real. I know I look good, but damn. Cause I had, y'all know I'm a little bit extra, but so I had on a burgundy coat. I had my hair laid, my face was beat, lashes on, boom. Like I'm cute on my first day of substitute. I was hype. So I go over to the next lady and she was like, oh my God, you, you are gorgeous. And she was like, um, you're here to sub. And I was like, yeah, another one, it's blue. I had like no hoodie, so I was like, I need to uh, just get something for like a chill day when I'm just running out and need to throw something on. They gave me my schedule, and she was like, oh, well, the English teacher is missing for first period, and you don't have a first period finish class, so I'll put you up there. So I get up there to the English class, and there's this woman walking by, and the door's locked, so I'm like, excuse me, can you un uh, unlock this door for me, please? And she was like, are you the sub? I was like, I am the sub. And she was like, are you sure? And I was like, this is the room, right, 219? And she's like, this is a behavioral class. And I was like, they told me it was an English class. And she was like, no, this is a behavioral class. So if you need any help, uh, just knock on my door next door. And I was like, oh, a behavioral class? Oh, y'all y'all trying to set me up. I signed up for Spanish, not no behavioral class. So I get in there and the first um, student comes in. I'm like, hi. And he was like, where's Miss, where's Miss Pink? I'm gonna uh, change up the names. Where's Miss Pink? I was like, she's not here, I'm your son. He's like, oh. So I see a stack of like algebra paper. So I'm like, do you guys do math in here? And he was like, no. I was like, okay, well, and what do you guys do? And he's like, uh, research. And I was like, okay. So then a, 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 another lady comes in. Oh, well, these are cute. Okay, some slides. So she was like, um, you don't really have to do anything. You can leave, you can go relax if you want. You don't have to be in here. They're not gonna do anything. It's just one of those days. And I was like, they're not gonna do anything. Okay, whatever. So sure enough, when the students got in there, oh, this is a nice little bag for when I sleep over at Jasmine's house. <laughs> Ew, this is pretty big too. So 
Um, all the students just had their heads down and they were on their phone and she I was like, okay, I'm not bothering y'all, y'all not bothering me. So I was just chilling and I was honestly like writing lyrics because I want to start making some songs. <laughs> um, so I was just chilling, writing some little lyrics and whatnot. And um, then the time, like a whole hour flew by and um, I, I was ready to go to my next class, the Spanish class. Ooh, my, my knees, <laughs> these are so cute. So, um, I packed up my stuff, I went downstairs. So as soon as I got downstairs, I write like my name on the board, I write Senora Kalia. <laughs> um, so I did that. Then the students started flooding in. They're like, whoa, where's Miss Blue? And I was like, she's not here. I'm your own. Um... Oh, these are cute. These kind of look big. I hope I didn't get like a big, they match my nails, they're so cute. Um, she's not here and then I see like mad different people coming in. So fast forward, like I'm helping them with their work. They didn't really want to work. So some of them just got their paper, threw it to the side. It was just like talking with their friends. Oh, these are cute. Look, lemons. Am I like totally corny for this? They're lemons with like the little strappy thingies on the hips. So cute. <laughs> so I was like, well, I mean, I'll help you guys with your work. I do speak Spanish. Like, do any of you actually speak Spanish? No. So how in the world did you get to Spanish for? No clue. So, anywho, I, 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 I did the roster and I realized like some people weren't there, but then I did have like a good amount of kids in there. So I'm like, okay, it doesn't seem as though they're skipping class. So I just hear people in the hallway like, damn, that's y'all sub. Oh my gosh, she bad as fuck. Damn, damn, damn. So I'm like, oh my God. And then, now they're up and in and out the classroom. I'm like, can we just come in, close the door, have a seat please. Thank you so much. Um, these are cute, nice and neutral. Like you can wear it under a dress cause it doesn't have like a, a seam on it. They're seamless underwear. Um, anywho, so they, they come in. So then the lady from the office came to like get my attendance, right? While she's in there, there's also two little twins in there and she's like, are both y'all in the same class? And they're like, yeah. And she's like, there's no way that we put y'all both in the same class. So I'm like, I don't know. I don't, they could be lying to me about their names. I really have no clue. Come to find out, only one of the girls were in the class, not both of them. These look like, okay, these are like high-waisted underwear or something. Kind of like a bathing suit or like little shorts or something. These are cute. Ew. So come to find out, only one of them were in my class. And then the rest, there was like 10 extra boys in my class that were just in there because I was there. And I had no clue, but I had given them work to do anyway, but they was playing with me. Um, so then um, I'm looking in the hallway, trying to get my students to sit back down. And there's like other students in the hallway and they're like, can I have your number? Ah, ah, ah. I'm like, no, that's inappropriate. Like go find your classroom. Like that's not okay. Cool, can we be friends? No, we cannot be friends. Like, I'm your teacher. I'm, I'm way too old for you, so please just cut it out, little boys. Like, it was just extremely, it was crazy. But I will say they weren't like mean or rude to me. That's what my mom and everybody else was scared of when I told them what school I was going to. These are so freaking cute. They were scared that the students would like bully me or be mean to me because I'm so nice. But, you know, I, I stood my ground. Um, some classes were, weren't as bad as the others. Not, I don't wanna say bad, but just rowdy. They were, damn, these were cute. Um, but just like rowdy. Not sitting down, wanting to ask me crazy inappropriate questions, but it was cool. Like the kids were actually sweet. Like I wouldn't mind going back there. Um, they, they, they made me feel young again. They keep me fresh. It just really amazed me though, their mouths, like all the B's and the F's and the, you're in the, mm, and the, the curse words just really like amazed me how they cuss each other out and how they have like mouths full of gold. And I'm like, what the heck? Y'all are way too young for this. Like, I don't remember being that bad in high school. Um, and just me overhearing like some of their conversations are talking about smoking and effing and sucking this and doing that. And I'm like, well, welcome to high school, huh? But I really don't remember like being like that in, in high, these two are so cute. I'm loving all these little strappy things, strappy things that I uh, chose. 
But yeah, like I don't remember being like that in high school. We've got to do better. We've got to do better. This school system is, I don't know. I'm honestly scared for this next generation. I really am. But I feel like God placed me here for a reason. And that's what I was trying to tell my mom and my friends when they were scared that I was going there. Um, that maybe God placed me in these children's lives to be an example. There's still hope. I mean, I don't know, if, I wouldn't say high school's too late, like, their lives are not completely screwed, but there's still hope and, like, just prayer needs to be done. And maybe them seeing someone like me, they would want to, like, better their lives or change because, honey, I don't know, I was a little hurt in there, I was scared. But, look how freaking cute, edible, ew. Those are so cute. Next week, or well, this week coming up, starting tomorrow, all week I'll be in the elementary school. So I'm definitely gonna be able to compare elementary to high school, but as of right now, I don't know, the high schoolers, they're cool, but elementary, I'm gonna be more hands-on, definitely, and they're gonna be innocent. It's easier to mold them when they're young and innocent. But yeah, my week was just crazy. Like, I couldn't believe the mouths that they had and how bold they were to speak to me like that. Like, can I get your number? Damn, you bad as fuck. And da -da -da -da. It was just a crazy experience. Um, yeah, I opened all that I had to open. Um, these underwear are so cute. Go cop y'all some. And I'm gonna let y'all know how this scrub works for my face. Um, just kidding. For my body, I'm scared to put it on my face because I'm sensitive. But I usually use Dove on my body, so I'll just let y'all know how the aloe works. Whatever, I'm wrapping now. But I thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you want more story times or want to know more about how my subbing experience is going, please let me know. And I love y'all.